The Narcissist's Illusion of Happiness, Part 2 The narcissist is never happy. It is nothing more than an illusion. They are hypersensitive to criticism. They are easily hurt or offended because they have a weak, fragile ego. They have to control the environment in a way where they always come out on top. But sometimes they do fail. Sometimes things don't turn out as well as they thought they would. Over the years, it has built up more and more anger, frustration and resentment. From things that they have never reflected on or dealt with. Where they are now experiencing great torment. They are experiencing severe mental suffering. Yet they do everything they can to avoid feeling the pain. So rather than becoming the tormented, they become the tormentor. And they inflict mental suffering on other people. They become abusive. They will do whatever they can to mask their issues or problems. But no matter what they do, the unfulfillment is still within them. They feel as though they're not enough and they don't know how to correct the situation. They don't want to change because they know that change would require accountability and they don't want to accept their faults or mistakes. It's too painful for them to deal with. So they deal with the same situations again and again in the exact same way as they did before with the same results believing that maybe this time it might work itself out they hold these idiosyncratic beliefs or impressions that are contradicted by reality or rational argument it's a symptom of the disorder And there is no way for you to get through to them because they are lying to themselves. They are lying to themselves so that they can escape reality. They live in their imagination or fantasy. They invent things in their mind to deceive not only other people, but also themselves. So that they can mask what is really wrong with them. They use denial as a form of self-medication. You can try discussing the truth for them, but unless it validates their delusional beliefs of superiority, they're not going to want to hear it. They have to believe that they are above everyone around them. It is a coping and defense mechanism for how they really feel about themselves. For the emotions that they don't want to accept or deal with. So they project it onto everyone around them. They create this fake world or alternate reality in their heads where everyone else has the problem. You can ask the narcissist how they feel and they will tell you that they're great. 
they will tell you that all is going well for them. But deep down inside, I can assure you that they are miserable. They are suffering inside. The narcissist is never happy. If you look closely, it is clearly evident in how they treat other people. If you want to know how someone feels about themselves, look at how they feel about other people. Look at how they treat them. Look at how they talk about them. That will give you all of the answers that you need. When you feel whole and complete and at peace with yourself, there is no desire or motive to bring someone down. The narcissist operates at the lowest emotional vibrational frequency of shame. They are shame-based individuals. And while other people may be at higher frequencies, whenever the narcissist is around them, they will quickly bring them down to their level. Higher frequency individuals cannot exist around these people. The narcissist is dealing with a lot of shame about who they are. And whenever they are around people, they will try to deflect their feelings of shame onto them. They have to reduce the worth or importance of other people so that they can then boost their own false sense of worth or importance. They cannot acknowledge another person's value unless they live vicariously through them. Unless they share their experience by imagined participation. And even then, they're not really acknowledging the other person as a separate being. They see them more as an extension because they recognize similar traits in them or traits that they aspire to have. Otherwise, the narcissist will only bring people down. They will only deflect their feelings of shame onto other people. They are never happy. They are never at peace with themselves. There is always something triggering in their minds. There is always something causing them severe mental suffering, which prevents them from ever being at peace with themselves. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries you can email me at narcsforevercoaching at gmail.com. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.